Hello, and today I'm here reviewing Magnus Chase and the Gods of Asgard by Rick Riordan. I love Rick Riordan. My husband bought me the Percy Jackson series, and then I got the Heroes of Olympus, and I just fell in love with his style and his humor. I was so excited to get this book, but I was totally unprepared. Like a sort of type of moron, I thought that my mythology books would cover Norse mythology. They don't. They cover Egyptian, Greek, Roman, and British's King Arthur type tales. I had nothing on Norse mythology. Luckily for me, Rick Riordan wrote this book and the main character knows nothing. So as we go along, we learn as the character learns. Thankfully, because I did not know. Um, this book was so action-packed, and the humor was there, just as in the Percy Jackson series. I love that we saw a cameo of Annabeth in the books, and that made me happy. Although, I was kind of expecting that, because everybody got the little name hint in the last Heroes of Olympus book. That also led me to some questions. What is Rick Riordan going to write after this trilogy? Because I realized that I just read book one. Book two will be out next year, and the following year the trilogy will be complete. I'm wondering what he's going to write after that. Because I'm so hooked on his writing, like, I hope that he writes something. And I hope that he already has a plan. Because I have to have a Rick Riordan fix once a year at least. So, I was kind of, like, bummed out when I realized that this was just going to be a trilogy. And I'm pretty sure that I'm right on that because that's what it said in here. I'm pretty sure. Um, yeah, The Sword of Summer is the first book in a trilogy about the Norse gods. So, I want to know if there have been any hints about what he's going to do after Magnus Chase. And... Kind of, if any of you know anything about Norse mythology, feel free to comment below and give me little tidbits. Um, I really had a lot of questions about Freya and Frey, like which parts of their stories were like accurate and which parts were like purely Rick Riordan's invention for the storyline. So like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what you thought about the book. And like I said, if you know anything about Norse mythology comment below because I know nothing and I'm trying to find a good Norse mythology book and I think I have but I have to order it. So any help is muchly appreciated. Thank you and have a wonderful day and I hope to see you soon.